Hello and welcome back to Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes 3 BT Grand Arena. Starting off the final week here on Doyle, we're fighting Barry Allen, or The Flash, or whatever you want to call him. They're from Imperio Mandalorino Aero Aoria. I don't know how to pronounce that last one, I'm sorry. <laughs> 953,000 legacy score, 1.6 million GP. <clears throat> um, What do they have on defense, though? It's a real question. Okay, Newt, CLS, Finn. Rex Qui-Gon. I wonder if that's a stun cron. Um but the but the but I see a Ray and Leia, that's great. I mean Amadala, of course, a Jabba, and a Reba as well. Fun times not to be had here, but it is what it is. Um trying to think of what I want to do for fight first. I guess we'll get Jabba out of the way. Okay, they got protection up, 72% defense, support roll, fun, not to be had here, but, eh, you know, whatever. Gotta deal with them somehow. Where's Plo? There's Plo. Where is my... There it is. Alright, let's get this show on the road, shall we? Okay, let's go ahead and do that, and hope for the best. Now I have every in intention to name this cat battle fighting the Flash or something like that. Or, oh look, I found the Flash kind of thing, you know. Because that's who the Flash is, is Barry Allen. Anyways, yes I know, corny, but whatever, deal with it. Uh, let's do that. Now the issue is, is when will it be my turn again? Okay, so we get to go, and then we get to kill Boosh, I hope, with Commander Ahsoka. Here we go. Awesome. As became a, th a thousand times easier. I hope. I'm really not holding my breath on that. Until we get through Chrysanthemum for the first time. Uh, let's do this. Yes, I know we can't stun. It is what it is. Just let me do that. Did we get an armor shred? Okay, we did. Uh, let's go ahead and cover Flow because he's got thermals like crazy on him at the moment. Uh, let's go ahead and leap. He'll be back. Oh, look, he's back. Shocking, I know. Another basic. There we go. Alright. Now for Jabba. Jabba, Jabba, Jabba. Oh, Jabba. What are we gonna do with you, Jabba? Are we put. No, this is. Okay, so yeah, we're not getting a new data from set soon, but. I was like, will this be the finals? No, we still have another conquest cycle with the new. Well, set 17, I should say. Not really new, but the newest set. I guess, leave more apt terminology there. So, you know, fun times to be had. I mean, it's just re-upping and getting more, like, Night Sister ones and Jedi ones and Imperial Remnant ones is my plan. At least that's that's the plan right now, um, you know. But obviously plans can change. Uh, oh, great. We have the revive tank roll. With 106% armor pin and 46, almost basically, just shy of 47% defense. That's unfortunate. It's really unfortunate for me. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I'm not a fan of seeing that, but... Yeah, oh boy, that's... That is something, alright. Alright. Kylo, you gotta bring the pain, bro. Because... Yeah, I'm still beyond annoyed that they didn't limit that revive roll to everyone that's not a GL for light side tanks because the fact that Leia and uh, JML can benefit from it is beyond ridiculous. Like, why in the world do they need to have the capabilities of reviving? You know? It's kind of annoying. No more R2. Is he stealth? Is. Dang it. 
Okay, well now he won't be stealth. Now the issue will be is actually getting him knocked out before he does anything drastic. Which wasn't an issue, so yippee! Uh, okay... Probably gonna lose Hux, that's okay with me. Uh, just basic. Yep, there it goes. Another poke. Let's do another leap. And then we'll go into ult. Momentarily. Alright. Go ahead and do this. Okay, I guess she's not gonna revive. Okay. Oh yeah, it's because whenever Kylo kills, it's permanent, but like... I actually wasn't expecting it to work. But... Whatever. Um... 206... 202, sorry, percent armor pin. is not good. And then, you know, the stacking offense and speed isn't the best thing to see either. But there's not much you can do about that, honestly. So, we'll just have to roll with the punches there. Um, we're gonna take this just because if we can get some crits off, Bane will do some bonus attacks and that will make my day. Because, yeah, Queen Amidala teams, they are something. That's fine. Let's go and do this. If we had been able to target Master Qui Gon, that would have been fine. But now we can, so watch this. Abracadabra. No more Master Qui Gon. Oof, and just like that, no more Queen <laughs> Amadala. Oof. Okay. Um. Well, we have Ray Ripise. That is. Oh, that's not good at all. And we got 91% defense. Oh, that is. Not good at all. That is... Uh, that is... Uh, uh, eh. That's not gonna be great. Hmm. Okay. Okay. This may or may not work, because with that Ripisei being able to ignore our protection, this may or may not go the way I expect it to go. So... I mean, also, if they get to magically increase my, or reduce my TM, that'll help them greatly. Alright, let's throw some rocks at GTR. Okay, there goes that damage immunity. I love having BS baked into these kits with the uh, healing immunity. So cool. So cool. Alright, um... Now for the fun of keeping everyone alive. I don't know why... Did she not have damage immunity up as Frey did that? What did I miss there? What did I miss? What in the world did I miss? I mean, it is what it is, but I just wonder... I thought she had damage immunity up before, like, right as Ray was about to use the leap from the... Okay, whatever, I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. Moving along. What am I gonna do against Reva? Anything that or whatever. Uh, ooh. 15% team gain, uh, 80% defense. What are we gonna use against Reva then? Where the where the world is my Darth Malgus and why is he not on offense? Why do I have Darth Malgus on defense? What in the hell am I doing? Where in the world is Darth Malgus? Is he in the back? No, oh, he is in the back zone. Okay. Uh, okay. Do we need to see anywhere else? I don't think so, but we'll do see anyways. Okay. Um. Let's see, um, uh, buh, 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 separatist. Do we need a tank? Not necessarily, no, but do I want to take a tank? Yes, yes, I do. 
just for the safety of it. So. Okay. Ah, yes. Before I even get a turn. Yes, indeed. Uh, sure, let's link Grand Inquisitor. Why not? Lovely. Huh. I don't know why it death marked him, but okay. Because I didn't cleanse the debuff off of him. I cleansed him off of this is Eternal Emperor, I thought. Unless the game's just doing stupid stuff again. Which is a very distinct possibility. So, whatever. Not much you can do about it. Go sure. Oh, cool. Yes, let's ability block him. Yes. Ah. At least you. Are you about done? Thank you. Ah, oh, how adorable. I mean, I can't link anyway, so there's no point in ability blocking me. So, you know? I almost asked why she revived, but then... You know, either Kron. That'd be why. <laughs> hmm. You know, I've never understood why shock doesn't prevent protection recovery. I understand why it prevents healing, but protection recovery, I've never understood why it doesn't prevent that as well. You know? Never fully grasped that as to why it doesn't do that, but yeah. Okay, what do we got here? Ooh, 15% TM. Obviously, the big Luthan roll is the only Luthan roll. <laughs> Luckily, they have no defense, but they do have extra potency and tenacity and armor pin. So that's going to be a bit of a nuisance to contend with here. So, um, you know. Uh, let's see. What do we have that could help them, if anything at all, really? Um... We'll do that. Okay. Okay. No, no. When will it be my turn? You know, just 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 out of curiosity, when will it be my turn? Oh, it's my turn now. Cool. Um, I forgot about the cooldown increase that they give because you know, of course, they needed the capabilities no. of cooldown increasing. No. Um, let's do this. Is no. it my turn? No. Maybe? No, no. Apparently not. Okay, um... Okay, that was... Really? Really, he's not gonna die? Really? There we go. That's better. Okay.
Well, we almost got rid of Saw. Almost in did or two completely yeah, yeah. different things here, but uh, actually, let's do this on Lupin. Now look at that! Now you can't revive and bring back more of your stupid rebel commanders. Really sucks, doesn't it? Okay, now for the Gungans. Gungans, Gungans, Gungans. Oh, TM gain on specials, of course. And I feel a sticker poking into my foot. Which is kind of annoying, but, you know, I will have to pick it up. Well, that is if I can even actually find it. Unless I'm just imagining stuff, but... Anyways. Um, yeah. Yeah. Um, let's do that because we have to. Do that because we can. Awesome, no cooldown increases. Lovely. Very cool, very cool. Not annoying at all in the slightest, but I mean, you know, whatever. Ah, yes, Charger, you get to suffer. You don't get to call anybody to assist. Well, specifically for Lynx, but you can still Carl. Ca Carl? You can still Oh, Boss and ass to assist, I think. So, you're not going to completely suffer, but you're still not going to have the most fun you'll really could be. I don't know where I'm. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Whatever. I don't know. I'm just here, man. I'm just trying to enjoy this final week of 3v3 without completely losing my patience. Trying and doing will be two completely things, I imagine. Two completely different things, I should say, because, you know. Are we three and... Are we three? Am I three and three on this account, I think, for this season so far? Actually, I can look at the... Not GG. Uh, let's see. I probably should also focus on the match. Let's see. Uh, oh, we are three and three, because... Yeah. Because I went 0-3 first week, and I went 3-0 second week. So, yeah. Why are you still recovering protection? You bastard. Easy. Now you have no protection to recover because you're dead. <laughs> Beautiful job, Rhea. And Nihilus and Savage. Beautiful job. Alright, um, 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 who knows how long ago by the time I started recording here on Doya, but like same night, same day kind of thing, you know. Um, so, but of course this one, I don't, I never got the trip datacron, no matter how many times I rerolled, trying to get the trip one. I also didn't get very many spent, uh, support datacrons in the first place, I don't know why, but I got loads of like tank ones and all, it was really weird. I don't know why the game thought I needed loads of tank data prongs, but, you know, whatever. It is what it is. How much you can do about it? Other than just roll with it? Let's go ahead and get some burning on the floor. Um, do a basic. Go ahead and get some rockets. Aha! Uh -huh. Nice, we got shock on for a moment at least. Uh, will this kill Kelly? Good job, BT. I'm always very happy to see you doing BT things and just annihilating these people. Okay, let's go ahead and increase our cooldowns real quick, I guess. Burning, maybe? I didn't do much, okay. Uh, torture? Beautiful. This won't kill, but... 
yeah. Go ahead and do that. And trip with the kill. All right, all right, all right. All right, um, uh, what do we got here? Damage reduction. Tank's own <laughs> Magna Guard is going to revive. Luckily, no extra defense. Uh, we're going to go with Wampa still, though. Because even though Stap is there, he doesn't have the um, rather annoying uh, Ami on him. to Because I think the Ami like, really, really diminishes Wampa's capabilities against this team. But I've also never tried running a Wampa against this team with the Ami. Because I am not that crazy. I am, I, I am, I am a bit crazy, but I'm not that crazy. Also, I am a little stupid. But that's besides the point. Alright, Magna Guard's back. That's fine. I don't really care. Perfectly fine. Go ahead and roar. There goes Stab. Now it's just a battle between Grievous and Wampa. That lasted a whole two seconds. <laughs> lasted two whole seconds. Now we're leaving Quill. And them alone for now. Because I've got to deal with these yahoos up here. Okay. Faction health, special damage. Oh, an ability block. Support roll. Very intriguing. Um. There's a thing. Don't know how much it'll actually help, but I mean, you know. It is a thing. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and do what we've been doing. Focus down Rex and then have him get the sacrifice off of fives with the uh, death mark. Go ahead and do this. That's fine. Let's get some shock on the board. Be a tough haul. Let's go ahead and do that. Oh, and look at that. We got a two for one. Sorry. Got the hiccups. Don't know why, but I do. Also, why is Captain Rex being the nuisance this time? You could just die. Thank you, Captain Rex. They also, like, delayed the inevitable. We're really just delaying the inevitable, but, you know, whatever. Um. Now they have a chance to dispel. Oh wait, a 65% chance to spell debuffs on itself if there's at least two buffs that, two debuffs that can be dispelled. 36% de defense, 54% tenacity and crit damage, and and stacking offense and speed. Hmm. Well, let's not be too rash here and use bad batch. Let's just overkill it. Let's just overkill it. Because I could I could be cheeky and do bad batch, but at the same time I would much rather not and have them potentially get annihilated by Anakin. Because that sixty five percent chance with the amount of debuffs that the bad batch can put out would be extremely beneficial for them. So no thank you. So let's go ahead and get around the whole army of like on Jin. By just not, by not using Bad Batch. And look at that. <coughs> look at that. Max Banners and I don't even have to worry about it. What do we have here? Speed up on basics. 49% tenacity and 33% defense. Interesting. Very interesting. What am I going to give them, though, to help deal with that? What do we have with crit damage-wise, I guess? Oh, okay, so it is the... Uh, Cassian roll. Okay. Or Datacron, I should say.
Bro, ain't no, ain't no, ain't no, ain't no fucking way. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. That's bullshit, CG. That's bullshit. Oh, speed up on basic yet again. And extra potency and tenacity. And crit damage. Now I gotta really think about what I'm gonna do against this stupid, 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 stupid thin team. Because I have no legitimate idea about what I want to do there. Let's look and see what we have option-wise on .gg while we do this battle. Because I really shouldn't have lost it, but I did, because they just freaking kerplapped me out of existence. So, I have no one to blame but myself. Uh... Here we go. Here goes the bullshit. Ooh, I shouldn't have done the, uh... Whatchamacallit. You gotta be kidding me. You've got to be joking me. He's gonna now recover all of his health and protection because they've now stun locked me. You've got to be fucking kidding me, game. You've. Mm, fucking bullshit datacrons for light side teams. Why do we need to have bullshit datacrons for light side teams? Why does anyone need to have. Speed up on basics at all. Why? Just fucking why? How is it we go perfectly fine through the first two zones, and then we get to these two little fuckhead teams, and they just magically open a can of whoop ass on me? Kindly fuck off with that bullshit CG. I really dislike this team, man. Really, really do. Why did it not remove his TM? I'm pretty sure that's what that ability does, unless I'm completely mistaken. Really? Fuck off. Wasted two teams for no reason. It is what it is. What do we have here with trench? Okay, s buffs on specials with 37 poor, 37 percent health steal is what I was trying to say. Um. Okay, who do we want to? Who else do we want to give these Jedi support from or whatever? Uh, I guess we could do shock, right? Maybe, possibly. I don't know. Why not? Why not? I'm kind of just annoyed that I wasted two teams, though, for no reason. Other than, you know, my own bullishness, I guess. Or believing in them to actually do what they were supposed to do. But, whatever.
The unfortunate thing is we have to wait for Newt to get even even get out of stealth. And also the fact that we wait on Django to even, you know, lose the damage me before we can kill him is annoying, but whatever. It is what it is. Still got him. Still got him. Okay. What do we have back here with Hondo? Buffs on... Whenever the game buffs recover health protection, crit damage, tenacity. Alright. Really wish my nose would stop itching. Damn allergies. Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, one down, two to go. Of course, we also do need to lose the um, hostage. Kind of issue there. Come on, a couple more hits. There we go. Now, will we have enough to get through Hondo? Oh, I guess we will. Okay, then. I guess I shouldn't have doubted them. So imagine how many points we would be at if I hadn't dropped two battles. Imagine. Alright. Uh... Of course, we can't really be careful here either. Or not careful. We have to be careful. We can't be too rash against this one because of the fact of um the tie dagger is out front so all right yeah 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 Okay, let's go ahead and call in my Tide Dagger, because the quicker we get to move them along, the better things will be for me. Hmm. Smart move. A little late, though, because I already called in my first reinforcement, but I mean, it is a smart move to actually blow up the hangar before calling in your reinforcement. So, I do like it. do like the effort game. Okay. Go ahead and call a mine. Now, do we want to get rid of their tie dagger or kill Malgus? I wonder. Let's get rid of Malgus real quick. And ba boom. No more Leviathan. I am gonna be upset though. Because it's <laughs> just the fact that I had two battles fail because of my own I guess mistakes of picking those teams against, you know, something that's speed up on basic, but you know. You wouldn't have thought those would have failed. But they did. So, there's not much you can do other than be like, ah, well, good job, dummy. So. Okay. Now, what is going to be the right move here? Do we go with the assist? Let's, let's see what happens. <laughs> I fucking knew it. This garbage fleet can't even do what it's designed to do, which is assist one another. Can't even do what you were designed to do, you fucking failures. 
Oh, would you look at that? Now we get assist after, 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 after the Outrider is dead. Of course. Because why would you want them while he's alive kind of deal, you know? Good grief, game. You disappoint me so, dis so much every time I use this freak. Every single time. Every single fucking time. Just cannot help but fuck with me. I, I really do wonder if it's just something with me in this game, or if it's something just like across the game as a whole for everyone, because I just, I don't, I don't get it, man. I don't get why this fleet is so, so dog water. I don't get it. I just don't get it, bro. Y'all do know you can assist each other, right? This isn't just a myth. You can do assist off of one another. It's a, a crazy concept, I know. Oh, but look at that. Now you gave them access to the seismic charge. Fuck, now I'm going to two-shot this fleet. Oh, dispel all buffs. Immediately recovers. Fine. That fucking makes sense. Why are you so dog water? For fun me. Why why are you all so fucking dog water? Just fucking how? How are y'all so garbage? Just, I don't fucking get it. How is that the worst fleet in the game? I just, it, it baffles me how garbage that fleet is. <laughs> and it was the fleet meta? Excuse me, but why? Why was that the fleet meta? How was that the fleet meta? I don't, I don't get it, man. And now that we have the punishing one on the horizon, whenever that actually comes, who knows what you're actually going to do against that fleet, you know? Are you going to still be able to uh, even use the affinity against it? Or is it going to be like a hard, like a, like a hard counter against the kind of deal, you know? I don't know. I guess we'll see. Oh, that's cool. Let me just, like, not get a turn with my scythe. That's cool. Quite literally not getting a turn with my scythe, even though his team is almost at max. And has been for some time now. But okay. The U to you game. Could you kindly stop being stupid for one moment, CG? Just, why must you be so <laughs> hateful with that elite? And I mean the rebel fleet. Like, you're so vindictive about making it a nightmare for me to use. I don't know why. I don't get it. It's kind of annoying, man. Kind of annoying. But whatever. Anyways. Focus on getting through uh, these guys. Let's do that. Get some more curtain bombs. What are these called? I don't know. Whatever they are. Get them thrown down, basically.
Okay. Now that Ray has wasted all of her turns with that uh, locked buff on her, it's fine. It's fine. Not like I wanted to utilize it and annihilate everything all at once, but you know. Oh, and it did irregardless of the fact of how many stacks she had. Never mind. My complaining was for nothing. So where did we end up doing? If it had just been the one drop on executive, been fine. But the two drops up front of it, no. So it appears that my worries about those drop fights on, you know, Finn and then uh, the CLS team and also the executor yet again, were all for not because they dropped the battle on the Gungans in the back zone. I'm like, oh, I didn't see that until after I saw the myriad of battles they dropped out front against Ray, Jabba, and Leia. And I do mean myriad of battles. That is a lot of drops before you can get to the back zone. So it will be another win, luckily. So that's good. Anyways, I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to hit like and hit subscribe. Um, and yeah, thank you for watching and I'll catch you guys later. I hope you have a good rest of your day.